And Nira, just fancy my luck seeing you stroll in here, bold as day. I expected a hunt. Uh oh, must be another damn assassin. Is there no compassion in your heart? Will you not reconsider? To put it as succinctly as possible, no. And I guess we're gonna fight. Monteron. Oh shit. Damn. Alright, let's get some healing on Kenneth. No sorrow for those lost in righteous battles. Sung. Alright, let's back off. Use a potion of cure moderate. Get back into fray. Alright, how's everybody else looking on hit points? Good. Alright, she's almost dead. Come on! Yeah, I'm not hitting worth a shit. Because all my damn skills are lowered. Or all my ability scores are lowered. Alright. Let's see what she's got. Hmm. Magical helm, scale, club, heavy shield, and a scroll. Let's grab all that. Helm of Ultravision. Ultravision, unlimited uses. Hmm. Let's give that to Kenneth. And let's see. Scroll, probably another bounty scroll. Yep. Alright, let's actually put that helm in a quick slot so we can use that if we need to. Innkeeper! Five rooms are the best kept on the Stay indoors tonight. Heard all sorts of weird things. What can you give me today? Just some booze. Alright. Let's see if we can get a room. My rooms are the best kept on the sword coast. I'd like a room. Five gold. I'll rent one for tonight. You do not dream often, but tonight the visions are vivid indeed. Long have you walked, but now you find yourself back amidst the stones of Candlekeep. Your former home looms before you, but the gate is closed and barred. Over the walls there is a candle in your old room, but as the light goes out, the brick surrounding the window closes together. The very walls conspire to keep you at bay. A familiar voice startles you. Though it is calm and caring, you cannot go back this way, child. You must go on. Gorion forms before you. And though his image should be comforting, it seems but a shade of his living self. He is dead in your dreams, as in life. The phantom of your foster father gestures toward the blackness of the wood, as though it should be inviting. Perhaps it is, in a way, but the traveling will be hard. As you think this, a smooth and obvious path becomes clear out of the corner of your eye. It seems meant for you, pulls at your very being, and promises to quickly lead you away from the life you once led. Perhaps this would be for the best, but it is a bit too convenient for your liking. You do not wish to dwell upon the loss you have endured, but neither should it be forgotten. Gorion smiles and fades away. The pull becomes a push, but you turn away, steadfast in your new direction. The way is not quite as clear, but it is sure to be interesting nonetheless. A whisper follows as you stride away, something vestigial and sinister that you recognize, but yet have never heard. You will learn. You don't look back. Hmm. Got a new feat, Divine Heal. Hmm. Let's take a look at that. 
Just like a paladin, you gain the ability to heal by opposing your your hands on a body. The heal value is the character level times the strongest stats bonus. Hmm. Huh. That should come in handy. Alright, so we're all rested up. Let's see here. Ah, oh, shit. Well, no. Yeah, that's because my stats were screwed want? up there. Alright, let's see. We got some commoners here. Got a drunk guy passed out here. Hey! Get out of me way, you crummy log. Go to Nashville. Oh, he's talking about the fair. Where is the fair located? The fair? It's just east of Nashkel. There ain't too many people there, though. Hmm. A little tidbit of information there, too. And looks like we have a couple rooms back here. I Let's get Monteron doing his duty. Oh, Frabdurus Day, Kalu Kale. Bust into these. Let's see what we got. Some gold. Let's go check this one. And some more gold. And a little bit more. And one last room to go. These are all just DC 10, so shouldn't be too much of a problem getting into them. And some more gold. I believe so. Okay, so that looks like that's all that's here. Let's get on out of here. And back outside, and it's dark again. Alright, let's see, I think... Let's go to this little tavern right here real quick. And then we'll get on out of here. After we find out what's all in here first. Let's see. Volo! What's Volo got to know? Uh, yes, the, uh, a tab. Hmm. Quite a bit of reading here. Let's see, he's got recent tales. He's got the tales about Nashkel Mines. Um, and uh, another hell, young miss. I'll be sure the unfortunate commander of the guard. Uh -huh. Let's see. My companions and I have interest in the mines. Tell us what you know. Let's see. Shortage is fairly uh, the ore shortage is fairly crippling the local trade. There's bandits, both human and demi-human, to raid the caravans. As though this were not cause for alarm in itself, production of the mine outside of Nashville has fallen. Mysterious disappearances of several miners. Also have interest in the story of the captain of the guard. Let me finish my drink. I've right, traveled let's go the back length and breadth of Farron, and there's always something new. The story about the Captain of the Guard sounds compelling. Might I hear it? Commander Brage has missing, been missing for weeks now, following a strange alteration in his behavior. He was a family man. He has turned to senseless mayhem, affecting a rampage the likes of which I have never heard. Prior to his mad rage, the commander procured a new sword. No way to verify. Hmm. Good luck on your journeys. Alright, bartender know anything? Never had rats. 
No, sorry. Let's see, oh, he's got his few drinks. And he won't buy anything, so. Looks like it's just. Otherwise, there's just Tones folk in here, nothing important. Let's see, we did have some journal entry updates. Let's see. Let's see. Rumor from Volo. Volo's rumor, yep. One talking about Captain Brage. And the iron shortage. It's under the completed portion of the journal. Alright, so let's head to the mines. Alright, let's head on over to this map transition over here. I'm thinking that one will get us to the mines. But we shall see. Okay, so we got the carnival off to the east and... What is this place? Fireleaf Forest is south. I guess we gotta go that way to get to the mines, so let's go. Fireleaf Forest. Alright, so we got some folks over here. Delgad, Alexander, and Sendai. Let's change the view here. They did a nice job with the terrain. Let's take a look at the map. Alright, so we're up here in the north. And we got transitions on both the east and west. I guess we'll head over here and see what these folks are about. Let's go check this out. Yeah, nice job with the Me terrain. Thinks you'll be pushing up daisies before the eve is Travelers through. from the north, halt! We trespass into Amnish territory. Are you saying that Om does not threaten Baldur's Gate? Of course not. Our mighty nation has better things to do than attack some self-important barbarian city. Go back from whence you came. Before you go, who are you that you would roam about the Cloud Peaks? It is a very dangerous place at this time of year. I am Sendai, the noble mer of the noble merchant house of Argrims. We have come out here to hunt game. Perhaps you would make for better sport. What kind of monster would hunt his fellow human like a wild animal? Of course I was not serious. I jest. Who be going now? Goodbye, peasants. And they are leaving. Alright, I don't want to spend too much time exploring this area either. I want to get directly to mines before some of my party members start getting angry and leave or something like that. Okay, so let's see, it looks like we gotta go across here. Oh, what we got here? Winter Wolf! Alright, let's get with it. Let's see if Charm Person or Animal might work on this thing. Apparently not. Alright, let's change views. Let's see how we're doing back here. And he's going right for. right for Zar. Let's back off here before Zar gets killed. Took a little bit of damage. Alright, Winter Wolf is dead. Start shooting these Zvarts. Alright, they're done for. Alright, so I'm thinking this is probably going to be a Winter Wolf pelt. 
Yep. That's for that one quest. Let's see, we got some remains here under the water. We'll grab that. And some more. Another short sword. Alright, let's change back to the other view. Oh, we got Daryl, Larry, and Daryl. <laughs> And let's see, we got some guys with Nature's some damage, so let's see, what do we got here? Let's see, Khalid, he's done a decent amount. Let's use Cure Light Wounds on him. And let's do Cure Minor Wounds on Tsar. And let's hit another Cure Minor on Khalid. Alright, so. let's go see what this uh, Larry and Daryl's are all about. Looks like it's on route to this tra map transition down here. Which will likely get us to the mines. Oh, shit! Alright, let's get the fight going on here. Yeah. Alright, made quick work of them. Let's pick up the remains. More shit to put us overweight. At least we got some gold out of that. Let's see. Let's talk to Daryl. Hi! And Larry. Hi, I'm Larry. This is my brother Daryl, and this is my other brother Daryl. Pleased to meet you. Why would a Zvarta Kobold and a Tassla be wandering around calling themselves Larry, Daryl, and Daryl? Yeah, I knew you guys are from the wrong generation. Yeah. I guess that's kind of an Easter egg for an old sitcom that used to be on TV.